Cardinal News is continuing its coverage from the New York Card Asset Show. We caught up with Mickey Fulp, the mercenary geologist, who told us what to look for when you're investing in mining companies. Well, the, there are three key criteria in the junior resource sector. It would be share structure, people, and projects. Now, being a field geologist, uh, the mercenary geologist, I very much value the project first, and it's a way that I can eliminate most of the 1,750 juniors from further consideration. With 1,750 uh, companies out there, uh, the goal is to reduce that number quickly to a manageable ones that you can evaluate. I like emerging environments, emerging market countries, so that is where uh, geologists have a chance to make giant discoveries because they have not trod there before. So in particular, I like certain countries in South America, I like uh, certain countries in Eastern Europe, uh, uh, and uh, in, the, in the Far East too. So these would be emerging market countries that have ha not had modern day exploration. Well, you always consider geopolitical risk too. So what it really amounts to is uh, you will uh, go into countries that are uh, perceived to be relatively politically stable, uh, but you have to take some geopolitical risk. So it becomes a risk reward uh, equation. Uh, the fact that you can go into a country, say like Haiti, which has uh, had a very tumultuous history and a lot of turmoil and then the recent earthquake but but a relatively stable gov a government right now with uh, UN peacekeeping forces and tremendous geological potential in Haiti well I don't buy I don't buy the the idea of peak gold not at all um, there are certainly uh, been a decline in gold production over the last decade, although last year gold production was up. And so I think what's happened here is we had a dead time post pre X from basically 1998 to 2003. There was no gold exploration in the world to speak of. Uh, once the price started increasing in 2003, um, we started seeing companies come back in, lots of money poured into the gold sector. Uh, a year or two ago, we had very little to show for that, but over the course of the last uh, uh, year and a half or so, discovery after discovery is being made. So there's a timeline, there's a, there's a, a period of time where juniors have to do the exploration to discover new deposits, and that's coming to fruition right now. For Kitco News, I'm Daniela Cambone. Thank you for watching.